Musul Panorama of Destruction is the largest piece in the exhibition, measuring approximately 3 by 10 meters. The tapestry was specifically produced by a company, a tech company uh, called Factum Arte for the exhibition, but it is based on a much smaller drawing that uh, Diala Zawi produced between 2017 and 2022. Despite its large size, the tapestry really retains the energy and the vibrancy of the smaller drawing, down to the tiniest details. And yet the size adds to the composition a historic, almost epic dimension. It does take a bit to see and read all the components of the drawing. The main focus of the tapestry is on human losses. As the eye wanders over its surface, we can see several shrouded bodies, many of them faceless, and they stand for the many victims, the hundreds of thousands of victims that fell because of the uh, war in Iraq. This landscape of destruction may capture the aftermaths of the Battle of Mosul, which was fought between 2016 and 2017 by Iraqi government forces, allied militias, against the militants of Islamic State that had occupied the city of Mosul in 2014. And yet it does take on a symbolic quality, lamenting really the progressive decline and the deterioration of the city, which was experienced over three decades of war, and at the hand of both external and internal enemies. Then mixed with the bodies are architectural and urban remains, and if you look carefully, you can spot the dome and the leaning minaret of one of the most prominent buildings in the city, Masjid -e Nuri, which used to be typical of the skylight of Mosul. You can also see architectural remains, the head of uh, statues that date back to the Parthian period, or Assyrian reliefs, the fragment of uh, a chariot uh, and a horse next to the bent tire of a bike, both damaged, past and present, really stopped in their tracks. It does take a while to get it all in and I do invite visitors to take their time and look and observe, take a, a calm gaze. It is also a rare opportunity to see an object that otherwise would not be on public display, so make sure you don't miss it.